Hey folks, welcome to another VR video. We are checking out Runner on Quest 2. This is a high-speed motorcycle runner, if you will. Uh, there are multiple levels where you're trying to outrun the cops and other enemy creatures and combatants. Uh, we should probably try to take that cop out. far behind us though. And they don't seem to be coming anywhere near us yet. There we go. Here comes another one. I can hear them behind us. Oh, there's one next to us too. That was cool. So it took three of those Kind of alternate characters out. All right, so we got some grenades coming up here. missing this guy. Maybe it was just a little too close. Alright, so we got some more energy. We needed that because uh, we don't we don't have that blue energy though. We need that. Alright, let's see. Can we... There's some missiles. Oh, a machine cannon. Darn, we missed that, uh... All right. I think we took that one out. Still a little blue here. I feel like we're probably gonna end up on a roadblock or something soon. So I want to make sure that we have enough. Whoa! It's coming up, though. So there is a checkpoint coming up, just as I expected. And we hit the checkpoint. All right, we took that guy out. That guy's out. Aw, oh, man. Gotta, gotta get, gotta get that energy. Gotta get that energy up. A bike is fried. Need some more energy. There's some. And we died. Boo. So let's uh, restart. Let's do that level one more time here. Uh, I don't know if it's an endless running deal or if it's actually 
multiple levels and I'm failing and I'm, I'm not really sure. Um, I like the motion. It feels pretty comfortable, to be honest. With this type of... It's not really artificial locomotion, but forward motion in a game. Sometimes it could make you susceptible to motion sickness. In this case, though, haven't really felt that way. I feel like, also, the way that you steer, the, the mechanic for steering and, and shooting is a little clunky. Uh, I almost feel like I'd like to lean back and forth like that for the bike's motion, kind of like you would if you were riding on a motorcycle, if that makes sense. But I do feel like I'm slowly getting the hang of it as I go. I'm just not overly confident playing yet, if that makes sense. What's this? Okay, I don't know what that means, but cool. Alright, these guys. Recharged our fuel, or shield rather. I don't know how to take those out. I'm really bad at it. There we go. Got some shield, got some more shield coming up here, so basically replenished. That's a good sign. But like, I don't know how far we need to get. I don't know really much about these checkpoint areas outside of they're dangerous and can hurt us. Yeah, and I, and I don't know how to destroy them, thankfully. We did get that checkpoint there uh, with a piece, piece of shield right after getting the checkpoint, so that helped. I've got another checkpoint coming up. Ooh! Give us a little bit of a burst of speed before the security scan again. Knocks down just slightly our shields. Okay, this guy again. Well, that wasn't good. I like this guy. I hit him, but it was cool. Said something like no clearance or something under him. 
I was really hoping for some shield to drop there, and I don't think it did, or if it did, it kind of dropped out of my range. There's shield. Beautiful. See, this bike was a bit more shielded. All right, now we can go this way. Give ourselves a bit more shield. And now we'll hit another security scan, unfortunately. I'm not sure how to get rid of those. There is a tutorial that does say what you're supposed to do. And unfortunately, it doesn't really do... this way. I'm going to pray. Unfortunately, okay, here's some shield. Come on. I feel like when we hit the security, yeah, it killed us. So that's that, unfortunately. But this has been a look at Runner, a game that is now available on the Quest platform. It's kind of fun. It's kind of simplistic in a way, I'm kind of lost on if it's an endless runner or if there's multiple levels. I'm probably just not good at it. But I hope you've enjoyed this video. This has been a look at Runner. I'll be back with more content soon. Until next time, get out there and enjoy some VR for yourself. And thanks for watching. Bye bye now.